feel like I've eaten a year's worth of saturated fat in one day. I mean, can you even imagine the heart attack statistics? Do you in ever this stop town? whining? Do you ever stop being so grouchy? I'm grouchy because I'm tired of getting nowhere fast. Officer, can I ask you something? Go ahead. What's it going to take to get a little cooperation in the state? Dusty! Have you guys even started looking for Paul Ryan yet, or is everyone just too busy eating donuts you know, to do any legwork? could you just excuse my colleague, officer? He's under a great deal of stress. Yeah, well, that doesn't give him any call to tell me how to do my job, and I'll be obliged to throw your colleague in a cell for harassing a police officer if he keeps it up. He's not looking for Meg's baby. He's just sitting around. You know, maybe the cops can't find Paul and Eliza because you are wrong. And they are not in Greenville at all. I'm telling you, that lady was lying. Do you not trust anybody? Why would somebody's grandmother lie to us? Paul probably paid her to tell us he was headed to Sparta. There's no way to know the truth. Maybe we should go to Sparta and find out. I'm staying here until I'm 100% certain that he hasn't left this town. Well, how much longer is that going to take, Whatever it Dusty? takes. I'm going with my gut. Who is it? It's the cops in Sparta. Maybe they have some news. Bonnie McKechnie. Yes, Lieutenant. Uh, you're certain? Yeah, thanks anyways. She's not in Sparta? Apparently not. What'd I tell you? Some place around here I can feel it. Well, if I have to stay in this town one more day, I will not go without decent food. Why don't you pick up some wheat germ? Look, we're in farmland. I'm going to get some fresh fruits and vegetables so our arteries won't turn into sludge. Do you ever think of anything besides food? Not when I'm hungry. Hey, do you remember that place we passed when we were driving around? Looked like a farm. Yeah, that's what it is. It's kind of a co-op farm slash market thing. I was thinking about checking it out. I mean, I just can't take another night of fried everything. Have fun. Why... I, I was hoping that you'd come with me. Why? So I can keep you out of trouble. Oh, don't worry about me. I'm not going to harass the cops. Well, make sure you behave yourself then. Of course. No, I mean it. I mean, rein in the testosterone and try not to kill anybody. Oh, look at you fast asleep. You gotta hand it to you, Eliza. You take anything in stride. This is my idea of heaven. Where's the yogurt? Hi, little one. You got a mommy or a daddy around here somewhere? Babysitter, even? Hello? You're all by yourself? Why would, why would somebody leave you here where they could just... It's weird. Hello? Is anybody here? Whose baby is this? No one is around. So you know what we're gonna do? We are going to call the police. I want you to worry, baby. We're going to find out who you are, and I'm going to see to it that you are taken care of. Finally! Is there a reason why this child has been left here with no one here? I'm here. I was in the back. So are you related to this child? No. Nope. You're not? Then how did she get here? And where, where, where did she come from? She's Edna's granddaughter. So, what can I get for you, ma'am? I'll take these. You know, you should watch this little girl more carefully. So, thank you. Bye-bye, Bonnie. You got a mind to finally give that guy what he deserves. Um, what? Why don't you go ahead and go on your own? What? No, no, no. I can handle this guy and still get us to the movie out of time. <laughs> I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna run to that store. I, I feel a little sick. Hey, what's wrong? Nothing. I'll be fine. You, you go ahead. I'll, I'll meet up with you in a little bit. Okay? Right. Don't keep me waiting. I'll call you when I have any news.
All right, Meg, feel better. I had to give you a ticket for loitering. I was talking to the mother of that missing baby. Yeah, well, make your phone call somewhere else out of my jurisdiction. Not yet. Not while Ryan's hiding in your town. Look, I already told you. I've looked for Are you looking for this guy or not? I'll keep an eye out. You do that, officer. Face it. Paul and Eliza aren't here in Greenville, Wisconsin. And they aren't in Sparta. I don't know. I think it's time to head back to Oakdale. Consult the police, regroup. It's the only sensible thing to do. I'm not giving up. Maybe if you were more interested in finding Eliza and less interested in eating food. Look, I was looking. I mean, actually, my heart stopped when I was at the farmer's market. I saw this little baby sitting alone in a carriage. And... Are you telling me this now? It wasn't Eliza. How do you know? It turned out to be some worker's grandchildren. A little girl? Yeah. About Eliza's age? I don't know. It's hard to tell. Maybe. I don't know. You sure it wasn't Eliza? No, I'm... I was a little suspicious at first, but the work was so blasé about it, I just let it go. Oh. Do you have a picture of her? No. But I know how to get one. Officer! What do you want? I know we're not your favorite people. Yeah, you got that right. But a baby's been kidnapped. And we are so sorry for being pushy before the both of us, aren't we, Dusty? Yeah, sorry. Um, but we we were really worried about this baby. Yeah, I got that. The thing is, is that we really need the help of the police. We can't do it without you guys. All right, I'm listening. We need a picture of the baby. The Oakdale police have a photo. We just need access to it. And you want me to get it for you, even though I happen to be off duty right this minute. Well, we would really appreciate it if you could get a copy for us. That's right. We'd be grateful. Is that a fact? Wait here. We should have gone with that cop to the police station. We weren't exactly invited, thanks to you. I don't think he's coming back. Well, if he does, it's only because I know how to talk to people. That cop wouldn't have given us the time of day if it were up to you. Meanwhile, we don't have anything. Here's your picture, ma'am. Oh, thank you, officer. That's her. That's the baby I saw at the farm stand. Are you sure? No, I'm positive. We found Eliza. <laughs> 